Why, hello everybody, my name is Shretex, and welcome back to Battle Lord and my... Oh, that's not the right one. And my crossbow only let's play. Everybody, get ready to start shooting. So, last episode, I had like 20 troops left. <laughs> not a very good amount, let's put it that way. I went back in Valandia and I recruited, as you can see, a gigantic stack of peasants, everybody. Now, of course, these peasants haven't killed anybody yet. They're still low level, but we are working on it. Uh, men, let's get closer. Move, move, move. I've also added a mod into this series. So originally we weren't using any mods at all, but I found one that was absolutely perfect for this series, and I had to add it. Is that a shark? No, it must be a twig. Or it could be a shark. <laughs> I, I didn't think they would have added in sharks randomly to the game. Can you imagine, guys? We had the uh, Jaws mod, total conversion mod for Jaws. You are actually a sea creature, and you get attacked by various things like sea turtles. That would be a mod I would play everybody. So I'll make it happen. Get to work, guys. Anyway, so I have gotten a mod in. I will explain it after this battle. I think it's perfect for any kind of like series where you're using one thing. We'll see it very shortly though. Oh, I'm going to get killed, aren't I? Something I do know about this game is that if you die, it's really bad. The AI is terrible. So we've got to keep my guys away from auto control <laughs> or it will be a disaster to say the least. Can we focus fire on the archers, please? So I'm actually a bit concerned in a way because we do have some crossbowmen. They're not very good, but... We also have a lot of peasants. I hope... Well, really, the only way to level these guys up is they have to learn by doing. So we're going to have to get these peasants to check that formation. What? No, 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 no. Get back here. <laughs> She's crazy. Someone stop her. So many of them. That was a beautiful headshot, by the way. I'm very happy about that. That one, not so much. Peasants, charge! I think I got the buff to get experience every kill I get on close combat as well. So if I just run around... Oh, don't kill me! No, 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 no. Get them, peasants. He's just blocking up and defending against like seven attacks. Because <laughs> no one changed tra attack direction. Oh, was a heavy armor guy. Nice. That was a lot of damage against that dude. Might be like a warband where I have to try and aim for like their arms and legs because the armor value can't be as high as the chest. Victor, good job everybody. So we lost 10 dudes, not great, but we got 41 level ups. Damn. We gotta let them go. I got, I got, it's really confusing. So I'm playing warband and battle at the same time and the games are very different. <laughs> so I'm like, earlier I kept trying to press um return to go to the mini map and I was like, that's not a thing in this game. It doesn't exist. Okay. That was amazing. I can't believe we leveled up nearly everyone, apart from this guy sucks. I don't know what you've done in your life to be this bad, but you're the only person that didn't level up. Anyway, uh, let's get that sword. Okay, guys, let me show off this new mod I found. So like I said, I was just buying my own business over the weekend, doing, doing what you normally do, you know, and then I found on the new page a mod which lets you customize how your party works. If I press Control P, you can see party AI control menu. Beautiful. So actually you can also do this for all your people. It's pretty cool. And also if you get a kingdom, you can do it via the, you can make your kingdom like specific as well. This is what I really wanted in games anyway, like a way of customizing what Lords do and what they want to use. So what I've done, I have made Grinnard now use exclusively archers. He won't get any inventory, any cavalry, or any horse archers. He will just aim to get archers in general. And the second thing I've done is I've made a custom template which tells him to just get Valandian peasants or whatever, anyone that can turn into Valandian sharpshooters. I don't know if this works correctly yet. This is, I literally just turned it on before recording this video, so we had to see. But in theory, it could mean we can make an army of just crossbow people, and then we can have a giant, like, combined clan army of crossbows. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. What can I say? It's going to be amazing. And one of my biggest pet peeves of this game of all time with parties is that they kept joining armies and doing absolutely nothing all game. It really annoyed me. But there's a button. Edit party options. I can turn them off going to join armies. This should be in base game. Yes, it really, guys, it really should be a base game. I'm pleased. <laughs> oh, I just got 40 recruits. Let's go and join an army and die. I'm like, no, stay away <laughs> and level up. 
Anyway, so this is it. I can do loads of things. I can stop them from joining armies. I can stop them from donating troops. That's another big one that annoys me. I can still let them besiege raid villages and take lords. There's a lot of cool things we could do with this. So it's really awesome. Also, I don't, there's active orders. Patrol an area. Besiege. Defend. It's awesome. This is what I want to see in my video games, everybody. Actual features. <laughs> things that are useful. Come on. Anyway, uh, moving on. So that's working. Now, I will say, if we go and look at him right now, it's been like literally... What time is it? It's been five minutes. Most of which is in a battle. So currently he's done nothing. I He has got some footmen and volunteers. But I gave him to him. Because I had to recruit some guys to go faster when I was going back to Finlandia. So that's why he has those. And we had to see what happens over time. But yeah. That's pretty cool though. Now. This episode. We are going. Everybody. To get a wife. I didn't realise at the time. But I made a bit of a mistake. I was trying to marry the wrong person. I should have been marrying someone cool. If we can find her quickly. Liana. Now, I don't think she actually is on the battlefield. I think she's just in a town, unfortunately. So, but I'm pretty sure she has some really good stats. Actually, is she better? Let me just quickly confirm. This is why I can't remember the name of the other one. There you go. Oh, it's a bit up in the air, but they are very close to each other. I'm not them both anyway. Yeah, so I have two options. So at least if we can't marry one, we can marry the other. They are kind of similar though, so I'm not going to go out and just go for one or the other. Let's go for this guy. Why are there so many allied armies here, guys? What are you doing? What the hell? What have we done? Fusion? I've become a surgeon. I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> Very random. Who are you? It is better we know each other's names. I think it's a bit dodgy. We've got to remember, it's not like normal. We actually are pretty weak. So we have to go for ones that we will definitely win. At least until we get higher level units. Because the basic crossbows can barely even hurt a fly. So we have to keep that in mind while playing this game. I Let's have a look around. So I did actually have some territory. Are they going to try and siege down Varchek? Interesting. We'll keep an eye on that. Because I'm pretty sure they're going to give it to me if we get there. Oleg. This is a guy I can kill. Get back here! I have something for you. It involves Bolt. Or should I say Fulman? I think Fulman was the Latin word. Uh oh. There's two different enemies here. But I think because they're separated, they both have mostly recruits. It should be fine. Let's go! On my command! Two peasants. <laughs> Archer! Step! Archer! Spread out! Infantry! Infantry! Guard the front! Forward! You don't just hide at the back. <laughs> Let's not get those guys killed. Oh, there's so many of them. Do most of them have shields? No. I think we're fine just standing here then. There are a few shield guys. If we just focus fire. Not that the AI could do that, but I can. On the guys without shields, we should be fine. Oh, 45 damage. I need a better crossbow. I think the better one's only better by like 6 damage though. So we have effectively have the best... Kind of damage we can get. It's just not that good. They're so close. Keep firing, men. None shall pass. Ow. It's like I'm playing in slow motion. So I've been playing way too much warband still. Oh, you're an enemy. How did that hit me? Oh, it's only two damage. I'll, I'll take it back. Uh oh. Not good. Not good at all. I should have spit my forces, to be honest. Oh, what the? Why is a basic footman doing that much damage then? What's up with that? <laughs> oh, what's happening here then? Oh, you won't anyway. It's fine. We lost a lot of troops in the progress there, unfortunately. Just kill the last man, please. There you go. Oh. 15 losses. That's not great, everybody. That's not great at all. We've got some renown for that, though. Yeah, I have to, I have to keep remembering to split the formations. But I, I, was, I thought we could just use the power of crossbow to win there, but the um, I don't think they do a lot of shield damage. Is that a thing? Let me know in the comments, guys. Do crossbow bolts do less damage against shields and arrows do? 
Because I feel like in real life, arrows would weigh down a shield so you can't carry anymore. But of course, we've this is Mountain Blade. You've seen Porcupine guys. A dude with like 100 arrows in his shield. <laughs> it did not matter in this game before. I don't know if it matter now. But anyway, uh, you're free to go. We can get some Imperial recruits while we're here because we are very close to Imperial territory. So it's not the complete end of the world. Uh, let's get all those people. Thank you very much. Upgrades. Even though we kind of got killed a bit there, my men are getting better. One upgrade at a time. Although I say that, the different, different damage between these levels is not a lot. Not a lot at all. Ah, it's okay. <laughs> it is what it is. Okay, we'll take that. Thank you, game. Good thing about killing random lords as well. You just get loads of money. <laughs> we will be rich. Not that money really does anything anyway at this point, but it's good to have, right? Yeah, let's get out of here a little bit. Let's go and sell these prisons at the nearby location. Now, I could also just buy a wife directly from the lord, but I think they're very expensive. I had a look earlier, and it was around 80 grand. So, not something I personally have on hand at the moment, unfortunately. I did spend a lot of money between episodes on various things. Like, I bought these... Well, I say various things. I bought these heavy bolts for, like, 16 grand. They give me plus one damage. Um, yeah. <laughs> Look, I'm just trying to get more damage from my crossbow, okay? It's some, we're living in some desperate times here. But luckily for us, we have loads of money we can get from uh, just killing some low-level guys. Cool. I should check, because there is a better crossbow. I just need to find it in the game. Um, not that one. Oh, wait a second. Can I get you one of these as well? I don't think it really matters much, to be honest. I mean, I'm not seeing much of a difference between the upgrade last time. But of course, the I had the Arbalus before. And it's only, what, four more damage? <laughs> a simple crossbow. Wait, I saw it. This is the one people mentioned in the comments. It has no requirement to use. So we'll buy one of these and lock it in. So if we ever get a guy we want to make into a companion in our party, like a, I don't know, for some reason, like a really good crossbow guy, or like a guy we want to turn into a crossbow guy, we can use this fella, because it has no requirements at all. It's pretty handy. Wait, where's your helmet? You do not have one. My bad. <laughs> We're getting a helmet at some point. I know there's also a mod I should try and get for future videos, which is one that auto-equips people. But I think it auto-equips you as well. I'd rather it just worked on the AI companions. Like I said, because I've been playing a lot of Warband recently, I'm like, oh, this feature is amazing. Why is this not on this? So I, I like the auto equip from the Perizno series is great. It, it really is fun. Anyway, uh, let's get keep moving, shall we? Oh, tactics. So we got to grab that. And we'll also grab Shield Breaker. Because I spend a lot of my time just whacking shields. Because the AI doesn't seem to attack very often anymore. Um, so we got to just focus on just taking them out. Oh. Going this way. I reckon by the time we get there, the siege has probably already started. Or that hopefully has started. Otherwise, it's going to be a bit annoying. Uh, yeah, it's going. Perfect. I'm coming in, guys. Let's do this. That was a really long loading screen. <laughs> okay. Follow me, everybody. Done. Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> that was close. I only got myself killed there. What is wrong with my horse? Okay, I'm just going to walk then. If the horse doesn't move anymore, I'll, I'll go myself. Follow me. Follow me, everybody. It must be... Is it lame? It must have got damaged or something. Very strange. Okay, let's get our guys moving forward here, though. The AI doesn't seem to be garrisoning the walls still. Oh, no, they're over there. I'm wrong. Okay, perfect. It seems to be hit and miss. I couldn't see what I was doing there. Uh-oh. Be careful! <laughs> One guy is like, oh god. Okay, I think we moved most of my forces up to here. There is a catapult there, though. I wonder if it can shoot down at us from this range. Could be a problem. Okay, everyone spread out. No, not scatter. I do not want to use scatter. I want to use... Boost. Move, move, move. Yeah, there's not really anyone to shoot, is there? <laughs> it's sad. We, we can just skip forward to the ram gets here, though. I would help push it, but I'm also aware that it can get shot by that catapult, so I'm going to avoid it for now. Wait, you guys found someone to shoot at? Where are you aiming? Near there, everybody. I decided to push the ram anyway, because that catapult was not caring about this thing. And also, future me editing. 
download the battle speed up mod again. <laughs> we need it, trust me. Okay. We're nearly there. I like how... Wait, did we just get hit by the cat? How? <laughs> Can it shoot us while ramming? No, we're fine. I think that wall is too big there. Okay, let's get this gate down. Let's go, crossbowman. Oh, that was a big hit there. We've lost so many units, and they've lost none because they got none on the walls. It's a pretty clever strategy, actually. I used to use it a lot when we were um, playing back in the day. You put all your troops under the wall, and they climb on top of it, and you just shoot them from the ground. It's awesome. But of course, in real life, you just arc your shots over the wall and kill everybody, but it's not that way. Okay, we're in. Now, I probably should try and guard, but I also have an axe, so I'm going to try and do both at the same time. If I see a guy appear up there, we are quickly change to crossbow mode. Well, I don't think there's anyone on the walls. I think they're completely demounted of defenders, so we should just be able to stroll in for the main gate here. Why, hello. Uh oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh oh, uh oh. How dare you. I can't aim up any higher if I... <laughs> Let's hope we can actually get this guy. There he is. Take my 46 damage. Guys, are we not attacking? What's going on here? Get in there. Be aggressive. I'm out of range of the rocks anyway, so we should be fine. Oh, no. The most powerful enemies in the game. A guy with a hammer. Okay, back up, back up, back up. It's taking a while to get inside. They are definitely holding us off here. That's a good one. I'm at risk of being hit by a rock right now, which is not fun. The flag's fallen! I'm trying to get the ones that are like that. Get through, get through, get through! Yes, I'm through! Okay. Now the battle begins. Crossbowman! Enter the village! Go, 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 everybody! Yeah, I don't know why I did that. I just realized I was facing the wrong way that way. Do that! <laughs> okay, also... Well, this, is a, this is a city, right? Okay, after this battle, I'm going to go and upgrade, change my perk so I have the headshot damage one so we can kill enemies. Are they retreating to the keep or something? They seem to be... What the hell? <laughs> what, how did that guy even get there? That was a long jump record, without a doubt. That guy got some airtime. We got so many units. Damn. A lot of deaths happened today. I lost my sharpshooters. To what? <laughs> what killed them? Someone's dying. There you go, victory! So hopefully the game will give me... This city. Oh! I just got two crossbowmen back. We broke even. <laughs> it's fine. Legendary. Okay, um, let's see how this works. So, I guess we just leave it for now, wait and see what happens. Hopefully I get given this place. If I do, I can assign my, my companion here immediately and we can get going with that. I don't think, oh, as this is a, is there any better axes here? Not that I can see. We get some better armor as well. My armor is not good. I mean, I was like, oh, I died. My armor is like mid-tier at best. I feel like we need to get, what is it normally, like 40 or 50 you can get up to in this game? So there's definitely better armor we can grab. It's probably going to involve a lot of money, but we can definitely get some better stuff here. Also, look at this helmet. This would have protected me from that axe earlier, everybody. I would have been totally fine. <laughs> it would have just bounced right off. It would have been glorious. Okay, so that's that, though. That's pretty handy. I want to try and talk to, who's here? I think there's tons of lords here right now. I don't think she would talk to me if she's in an army, but we can try anyway. No! I knew it! 
I guess we can either hope that the army just falls apart. We can actually check, actually. What army is she part of? Because so I can quickly join it and help remove the cohesion by being in the army. It's a perfect plan. I like all these little flags. Do you think they'd be spread out? Like, no, <laughs> we need hundreds of them. Get over with the spam, shall we? Be gone, spam. I reckon I should have this castle. Thank you. Oh, that's great. <laughs> we immediately just got given the city. So, I did say we want to make sure we get my dude in charge of this. He has absolutely no stewardship at all, but at least he's the same culture. Like I said, we've got some really bad laws in the old uh, the landy here. Owner culture negative three. Really, really bad. <laughs> so, if I just pop this guy in. We now have negative three. That's still not... I was hoping that would just fix it, but it didn't do it much at all, unfortunately. Well, I guess I have to go with plan B then. So... How do I do this again? If I cancel all these buildings and put you on settlement loyalty, we can break even. Excellent. That is what I want to see. But then we're kind of stuck forever then. We're just stuck at this situation where I barely get anything. But at least if you've got high loyalty, it's good because it means you will get yourselves at least some money. I could, in theory, what we can potentially do 1,600. We can maybe try and rush a building to help us out a little bit. I can rush this one here. Before the loyalty gets too bad. 23 days. We can give it a shot. I mean, we have to keep an eye on this place. If it gets to a point where it stops construction because of loyalty, we'll have to go back on the festival games. But at least if we get this, we get a permanent mini boost to the governor's loyalty. Now, as this guy has absolutely no skills, he's not actually helping, <laughs> to be honest. I... Don't know if he has the capacity to upgrade stewardship. Not really, no. He's not a very good choice, but it's hard finding Sturgeon vassals. So I, I just had to make do. If we find a better one, when we go into taverns, we'll replace them and kick this guy out. It's not a problem. Because uh, there are things... Governor. When do you get useful governor skills? Do you get useful governor skills? Tax income. <laughs> Quite far away from the start of the game there. I mean, this one's pretty handy. Half growth and villagers band to govern settlement. That's a pretty good one to get. That's the uh, like the village power. Prosperity, it used to be called in the old war band. Okay, well, anyway, that is what it is. I'll leave that for now. Now, Manage Dungeon. I noticed that there was a very large amount of lords in here earlier, so we're going to take all of them with us. <laughs> and we're going to sell them all. There you go. That worked out great. We now have money. <laughs> if only I can buy a wife now. Oh, wrong button. Okay, also, while we're running around, how are we doing with a clan? Oh, we're miles away. We are very, very far away. Let's get some combat going then, shall we? We need to get renowned so I get more troops. Now that, though, is probably too many. Yes. Did I have a Lord Prison I missed? <laughs> it's a bit weird that I had that offer there. Okay, the army squad is going into Cranog Castle. I... No, we're, push we're pushing them back. We're going in! Let me join! Let me lead this army to victory. Ah, shame that the other one got away. I was hoping for like a double battle. I still think... Did I mention this last episode? If I did, I apologise. It's still weird that since they changed it so armies can work in teams, you now just have one army with three different commanders. <laughs> it, it always go to exactly the same target. It's a very strange situation. Okay. Follow me, Follow me everybody! Oh, also I want to point out, someone mentioned this in the comments, like, oh, you didn't use this squad. Because um, you only get given one squad if you're a commander normally in an AI, AI battle. It says I can use horse archers. I'm going to press 4 right now. You can't tell I'm pressing 4, but I am. It doesn't work, guys. It's a it's a visual bug. It's totally fine. Okay, everyone, this way. Stay close. That is a lot of crossbowmen. The best thing about this as well is that normally in army battles, you lose control of your other troop types, so they might just get killed. It's perfect, because I only have crossbowmen, so these are all my own troops as well. Oh, uh, can we get close and just release a barrage of death on these horse archers? Are oh, they going to get away? Are they going to attack us? They might do. Oh, we're being defensive. Archers, 
Don't give me everyone. Turn around. Turn around. <laughs> I don't feel I can take on a 355 shield ball surgeon, so we're gonna just retreat and we come back later. We need to run away though. Get out of there, everybody. Wait, wait, wait. Turn around and release barrage. Barrage. Oh, I'm gonna need to kill one of them. How did they survive? Okay, but some of them are dying now. Perfect, perfect. No, no, don't kill. Run. No, run, men. Run. <laughs> oh, what's going on? Why is that? Esc what's going on? Run, run away. Okay, we killed like all the cavalry, but we're being chased. The great chase is on. Someone play Benny Hill music. I would, but I'm not sure if it's copyright or not. Ow, my face. Damn you, man. Damn you. Slow motion horses is. I think I'm spoiled by my Speed 51 Corsair from Warband, which moves at the speed of light. I, I, I need to actually wear a seatbelt while playing the game. It's, it's ridiculously fast, everybody. Okay, everyone, get out of it. Are we retreating even further into the abyss, men? Wait, wait, guys. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Barrage! They're being hit a lot, but they're not dying. Um, I killed some lords, though. Wait, one more shot. One more barrage. That's gonna death. Run, 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 run. Oh! We're doing something. So, how's this gonna work? Are they gonna stand here and I can sound this hill? Because that'd be amazing. I would love that. I can become the hillman. Power of hillman. Forward! Or are they going to keep running away? They don't seem to know what they're doing. Like I can run faster on foot at this point. Okay. Take this. Oh, a pretty good shot. Okay, the AI's in zone. Perfect. Stand here, men. Ammo is already at nearly 50%. Okay, everybody. I'm sorry about the random cut. The OBS crashed. I didn't realize it crashed until afterwards because I was running around. And I was like, that's weird. The recording's not ending when I press the hotkey. And I had a little, a little warning in the bottom right of the screen. It said, OBS has crashed. I was like, damn it. <laughs> I just lost 20 minutes or 25 minutes of footage. It's okay, guys. Uh, that battle we were in, we won very easily. I think we lost 10 crossbowmen somehow in the end. I literally, I kept running towards my allies and eventually the ally formation actually attacked and we absolutely devastated them. As soon as the infantry went in the combat, I pressed the shoot button. Everyone died. It was beautiful. You had to take my word on it, though, because you can't see it, of course. So I think... I don't know if I did, like, two or three battles since then. I'm kind of just running around the map randomly, killing enemy lords. I did do a few battles with the clans, and I was like, why am I doing this? Uh, sorry, armies. It's not getting me anywhere. So I went off to do it by myself instead. Uh, so that was a quick, brief history of what on earth happened. I got 106 troops because I nicked them from the garrison of the city. That was the general gist of things there. Uh, I feel, still feel bad though, because we still have a peasant. <laughs> Peasantus. And also my... Oh, there's two... Wait, why have I got a footman? Get out of my party. Unacceptable. I can't get him. We'll find a way later on. Any what a fool. Ah, oh, I thought that was going to be a glorious shot. This is so much wasted ammo right now. <laughs> the enemy party's not that big, so it's fine, right? There you go, enemy down. They're coming, men! Fire! Infantry! You are to guard the flank at the front, okay? You are the bastion that will protect the crossbowmen from certain destruction. Oh, these guys are not high level. Oh, 50 damage against a peasant. Sad to see everybody. I feel like, next time we play, I'm going to go, like, really heavy on infantry. I feel like the Age of Range is over. And I want to see, like, a full-on doom stack of shield wall going around. It's going to be pretty cool. Jo no, Steve! Get him, buddy! Believe in yourselves! You can achieve anything! This is where the AI will not attack in any situation. <laughs> Excellent. Why, hello there. No! He blocked me! Get him! That, that, not the horse, guys! When did I say shoot the horse? Don't hack at me. Okay, I'll let you off. I'll let him off. Okay, perfect. I hope this is recording. <laughs> Please, OBS gods. 
Bless me of your recordings. Sorry. Feel free to go. Yeah, so I need to get some more experience, everybody. We need to go. Look at these. We are slowly getting the crossbow army we deserve, everybody. We are going to get the most powerful people the world have ever seen. Who leveled up there? I'm not sure. Oh, also, I don't know if this was in the video or not. I don't think it was. I also changed my perks. And now we have 50% additional crossbow damage. Which means, if we shoot a guy in the head, he may actually die now. Which I think is a massive boom over before, which was nothing happening. <laughs> anyway, everybody, I need to do... Well, I reckon we go for some more of this. I need to get this rating up. Not this one. Oh, wait, yeah, actually, this is one. Casualty survival chance. It's not a lot right now, but more's better, right? It's fine. What was that noise? Freedom of Oryx. Yorick, I, did I have a prisoner somewhere? <laughs> I guess I did. I'm not sure where, though. Anyway, now that we've randomly had more time, because I've already played 20 minutes off a camera, we can actually go around and try and get my wife. Though, unfortunately... No. No. Actually, I'm saying no. Actually, I think it's a good thing. <laughs> I like fighting enemies that are near my homeland so I can get my own troops. That's what I want. Let's head back towards this way, shall we? It looks like everyone's splitting up and heading back as well. I notice there's, there's still three armies. I need one of them to break apart so I can get my wife. How? Where are these prisoners coming from? Someone must have dumped some prisoners in one of my castles. Because I remember we sold them all in here, right? I'm pretty sure there are no prisoners in here. Let me just double check just in case I'm wrong here. Uh, dungeon. Oh my god. <laughs> Well, there you go, everybody. That worked out great. We are now rich. I can probably afford to buy a wife now, though I would still like to do it the good old fashioned way instead of being a scumbag. We'll try our best, though. Though, unfortunately, being a scumbag comes naturally to me and I can't stop it sometimes. So, we have to see how this works out. Where is my wife? Your wife. Where are thou? He's gone somewhere else. I think she was in an army that was around here and it's disbanded. Which means, everybody, are you ready for this? I can summon my future waifu, which costs 44 points for some reason. Uh, I guess she doesn't like me very much. <laughs> and then we can try and woo her. That is going to be the play here. While this is going on, I'm going to head back towards the proper Valandian land. Land? <laughs> Not lad. The Valandian lad. Ah, beautiful wife to be not actually my wife yet i have a question for you my... damn it it's okay we can fix this i just wanted to talk to her that was the only thing i wanted okay everybody we have to channel ourselves in this situation 71 percent with we failed it's over i'm so sorry everybody i wanted to get a wife it's just not possible 71 percent for me is probably, what, 20% chance of success? I'm actually surprised we've got the other one there. So we now have to buy a wife instead. <laughs> now that that's happened, we are doomed forever to having to buy a wife. Now, who is your clan leader? I pressed the wrong button here. What am I doing? Oxhall. Okay, everybody, we're off to get a wife. There's also Liana. I feel like I kind of prefer Liana because I understand her the same her name probably. So... That is a big boon for me. I actually... <laughs> there was a girl I used to know. And her name was like very like, very strange to me. And I just never figured out how to say it. <laughs> like, I knew it for like a year and a half. Sometimes I just randomly say the wrong version. I'm like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm an idiot. It's okay. We all know this at this point. It's not a problem. Okay, so we're going to grab some dudes. I feel like... Oh, they're so... Why are they so expensive, though? That's not enough. That's nowhere near enough. I need... Oh, so expensive. One day... So that's too far away. I mean, we can try. I mean, let's get some guys over here. I feel like we can do this. 108. They're already attacking. I oh, know. I reckon we wait. I reckon we wait until the reinforcements get in. Can I get anyone else? Get over here, buddy. 
The thing is, they got... Where is the last person? One day away, 18 hours away. At least we can directly track. Brilliant. He's going to get here in time. Okay, it's fine. Hurry up, brother! Brother, come on! Quickly! He's so slow. <laughs> I came in 2.8 speed. Slowest man the world's ever seen. Gary can do this. We can do this. We're going to jump in. It's it's winnable. It's winnable. Remember, we have all the siege weapons at the start. That is what's going to make us win. Go, go, go. Now, where are the catapult there? Okay, I need to get on the catapult and destroy their siege weapons. Especially that fellow over there. That guy needs to... The ram will kill us. We can probably survive the towers, but not the ram. Up my way. He wasn't even aiming at him. I think that should actually work, actually. No, I was way over. <laughs> Where did that go? We don't know, sir. It was never seen again. Okay, uh, let's go down to the bottom, which I think is going to land around where the steps are, and then we go up a little bit, and then we fire. Ah, oh, it's messed up. But the good news is, we know where it's going to land now, so next time it will hit. I need to hit this, I think, three or four times, so if I don't manage that, I think we're doomed. Yes, it counted. Oh, I thought I missed for a second. I was like, how? How have I done this? Come on, buddy. Load, load, load. What? That still counted as well. It's fine. Next one will definitely hit still. We might have to reduce the range a little bit there. So we got two hits in. We may get two more. What? Right. I've got it. Okay, excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, do I want to go for that siege tower? I don't think I do. I think we leave the siege tower alive. Oh no, but then okay, no, we definitely win if we kill this though, right? I keep forgetting. I keep thinking this is another game. If you, oh, that wasn't right. <laughs> yeah. If you win a siege, the enemy doesn't retreat; they just evaporate into your like they get captured somehow. Like you capture all of them, even though they can just walk away. So I will destroy them, and regardless, then I win. Keep firing, men. Hurry up, buddy. I don't think we can actually get it anymore. No, it goes over the top of it. This enemy has reached us, fortunately. I want to try and do a bit of a Hail Mary shot. If we just load up again. I reckon this would hit that. Ah! Oh, that was not only a good guess. It was directly in the middle of that formation at the same time. That was pretty badass. So I think we'll fire a few more of these. I don't normally like using siege weapons, so I like fighting myself. But one, I'm using a crossbow, it doesn't kill people. And two, look at the engineering skills we're getting right now. We are getting tons of experience. Yeah, I'm just going to keep firing. they got a little bit of time anyway until they open up the gates. Because they had to climb up. Then, finally after that, they will actually start fighting properly. How many shots have we got there? I'm just going to sit here. Now, that formation will move in a second, though, because they're going to have to go and start. Okay, the main thing is started. One more shot. Good luck, men. We're going in. Rah. <laughs> Actually, it technically it's Wraith or something. I don't know. It's some kind of word. I should be using this for now. What the hell? <laughs> what happened there? Where are our infantry? Do we not have any guard guards? We might still be in trouble. We don't seem to have guards. Just crossbows. <laughs> Perfect. We were doing crossbow only, and that's exactly what's happening. Okay, that was not effective, unfortunately. There's so many of them. I'm going to try and get the ones with good armor. Or just any of them, to be honest. <laughs> any enemy we kill is probably a good one to get rid of here. Okay. Close combat mode. They're flooding in. We can still lose this. If we have no actual guards and we just have an army of random peasants defending us, we will lose. Scab it. i got to try and not get overwhelmed by enemies. If I die, I won't be able to play. And that'd be boring. For me. Oh, 
Oh, there's so many of them. The gates really have opened here. <laughs> the floodgates. I think, I think we're going to lose. I don't think we're going to win this. One hit from that guy in there, by the way. He's a high level. Okay, that's it. Oh god, it's it's literally man to man. Man to man are fighting here. We have to get in here. What's happening in this part? Hey brother. Your sacrifice will not be forgotten. Oh no, I took a hit there. I didn't realise I was gonna get whacked. Nope. Be back. Oh, this is so close. Oh, God. Oh, that was some... Oh. They're running. We've done it. Now that was a close siege. <laughs> Wait, they can't get away, though. Can they... You fools. Oh, now you become a super, super Saiyan. Get back here, Super Saiyan. Nah, 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 man. Oh, it's a ramp. That's how they got up here so quickly. I thought it was a bit strange with the speed there. Hey Why am I so slow, everybody? Oh, come on! Oh, this is the most disappointing weapon. Oh, hey, hey, ever guys. Good thing you didn't turn around and try and kill me there. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. They were not happy about me killing their friend. You're going to turn around as well? You're going to keep running? Death. <clears throat> okay, maybe a slight lack of death there. Fight me! We must duel an oath sworn. Get him, Hammer Man! <laughs> True hero of Batania. Go. Oh, pretty well. 50 renowned. I think that was a pretty good one. I, I will take that as a win. Uh, we did lose a lot of troops, but unfortunately, luckily for us, we're actually next to our homeland, so we can just go and get more. Is more is is perfectly safe. Oh, sorry. Release. We need to get that charm, everybody. Um, I wish this would save. Please save. I'll see how many I can dump into this prison here. Not surprisingly, everyone's leveled up, uh, including the footman, who is still alive somehow. I wish he would die <laughs> if he doesn't seem to want to. Uh, oh, oops. Oh, helmet. Do you know what I just realized as well earlier? We This guy hasn't got a helmet at all. Uh, let's give him one of those. Hey, good buddy. Legendary braces. I don't, does it really matter if this guy has equipment or not? I mean, people are like, oh, like, you never got your companions. Does it matter? They never level up, guys. <laughs> They're not getting stronger. Done. Okay, I would like to not do anything because I'm not allowed. I would also like to not. That was the wrong button. <laughs> that was not the plan here. Donate troops to garrison. Goodbye. For, wait, if I do this, he becomes stronger. Goodbye, Spearman. Good luck out there. I'm sure he'll be fine. So let's get hell out of here. So I, I was going to say, we could just go to the battalion town and sell the prisoners quickly. We're at war with them. What am I thinking? Uh, I'm going to, unfortunately. Did all this, didn't I? Oh, look! It's working! He only recruited Levy Crossbowman. It works. Yes! <laughs> this is awesome! Okay, so we're going to disband this anyway, because I need to go and buy, uh, buy a wife. But leave that be. I'm going to lose all these prisoners, right? So we need to get rid of that. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's go down. Perfect. So. Perfect. Uh, control or vigor. Oh, movement speed of troops in the campaign map. That was very decisive. And also famous command, everybody. Oh, I just realized if we did that a second ago, we could have got ourselves um, 60 renowned instead. But I'm really excited about the 200 experience. It'd be a lot easier to level up our troops, I think. 
Okay, um, let's also grab... I'm gonna get more engineering. So if that happens again... No, 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 I changed my mind. After I saw the abysmal amount of increase there, it gets some more medicine still. Okay, so what do we want here? We want to get... Yes! Plus three damage to a quick crossbows. It might actually kill people. We'll create that. We're also going to get... Ooh. Siege works. Ammunition when besieging. That is extremely useful. Well, actually, I say that. Now that the AI doesn't go onto the walls every time on certain maps. Oh, I guess, no. If we're going fighting Britannia, they seem to be working on the Britannia map. So I guess we'll pick this. Done. They need to work on that. Those Sturgeon maps are cursed. They need to uh, figure out why they're not working properly anymore. Uh, when I say that, I mean, I'm referring to the troop range troops not going onto the walls. It's very odd. Anyway, uh, let's keep going this way. Now, I need to find someone, wasn't it? It was in Oxhall. I'm looking for a certain lady who can help me find the love of my life. Though, unfortunately, I can't remember exactly what clan she was in <laughs> it's she's in a clan but what one no one knows everybody how am i this unlucky with there she is where are you so she is currently over here let's go and talk to her shall we yes i think we definitely have enough money anyway now so we should be able to easily no don't tell me that depression where's I don't know why it's telling me that. <laughs> you have a quest, sir. Oh, I should have dumped those prisoners so I can move faster. We'll sell them in a second. Yeah, unfortunately, I've got some problems with uh, herding right now because I lost a lot of troops. So if we just get some more, we should be fine. I should have grabbed some on the way over because we could have saved some time there. Okay, I'm pretty sure she should be in here. Yes, she is. I think I already know what's going to happen, but we're going to leave it to the video to decide. I think my dreams have been uh, ruined. What? That was some speed. <laughs> that was like the speed glitch from uh, Mass Effect Andromeda. What's going on in here? This is a bit interesting to say the least. Um, I'm trying, I need to get to, wait, is she not here? Oh, she's over there, my bad. So I'll leave you guys be. Wait, what is this? One, two, oh no, there's two, oh, there's three guys. What kind of party is this? <laughs> I thought for a second it was like a harrow. I thought the guy had like six girls and one dude. And I was like, damn, man. What a hero. Living the dream. Yours is not a face I know. Hello, I would like to buy your daughter, please. Oh, she is doing it. Okay, so let me just double check. So we got her. 103. Really good stats all around, to be fair. And I just want to check Liana. Oh, they're so similar, aren't they? Yeah, I think we're going to go for her. So we need to change tactics. I'm sorry, Baroness, but I have found a better way forward here. Also, I swear you had blonde... Oh, no, it's, it just kind of changed. <laughs> it might just be the headdress changing the colour of the hair there. So how do I marry... I could just go directly to her dad. Yeah, I think we're going directly for her dad. Where, who was your dad? Aldrich. Located nearby. I'll be back! Mark my word, I'll be back. So hopefully it's not too far away. We'll have to see in a second. I need to get some more people. Thank you. Oh, prisoners. A battalion. Companion. We we'll hired this guy to be a... Nothing. <laughs> I changed my mind. I, I overestimated the ability of having... Clan, uh, sorry, governors be the same culture. It was literally plus one. It was not effective in any way. Oh, I think he might actually be inside one of these armies. No, he's around here somewhere. Yours is not a face I know. Why are you talking to me? <laughs> Did I click on you by mistake? <laughs> I must have. It's like randomly talking to me. Jumbo Tarsal was under attack again. They did not get good luck here. 91, get in there. Need to get rid of... Actually, no, we're okay. Herding's gone now. So we are back where we were. I'm getting a little bit more bonus from my movement speed as well. Where's this guy gone then? 
Oh, he's over there. I'm coming, buddy. There's another big battle we can do in a second, but we'll do it next episode. I'm going to go for this. Wait till the morning. We will help kill this castle. Why not? Everyone fully upgraded? No, they're not. That must have been from the skill we have. That must have been from... Um, the XP boost. Cool. That <laughs> saved me some time. Sergeant's in blue! Oh no! <laughs> that was a lot of fire. Hey guys, I caught a little bit out there, but I, I'm a bit up in the air with Siege at the moment. It does seem... That was bad. How did that even land out there? <laughs> it does seem that the if you're attacking someone, it doesn't work properly. Uh, the Siege defense. I mean, like, what, we're two minutes into this battle at this point? Yeah, two minutes in, and there's... Where are the archers on the walls, guys? They, they've broken it. <laughs> they need to um, look into this properly because uh, seniors are getting, I would probably say over the years, a little bit worse. There's more and more bugs adding up and it's not really experience you would expect, unfortunately. I, I, sorry, I don't like being negative about games, I, although I do do it often. I do apologize, but they, they need to work on this, guys. I mean, Warband, brilliant game. Worst thing about it was the seizures. Baron Lord, seizures. <laughs> they need to put more effort onto it. End of the day, even if you win every single field battle, and have like epic jewels. You still need to take over sieges. Sieges have more effort put into them. I'll stop now, guys. I'm sorry, but it is a bit annoying. Let's try to break down these gates. I've got to keep an eye up here, though. Oh. No one shall shoot me but me. I can't reach that guy. <laughs> need that? That guy dies standing up. What a hero. Okay, go, go, go! Oh, there's more than I thought. There's more than I thought. Back up, back up. They may actually hit their own troops with the rocks. <laughs> I can't move anymore, though. If he throws again, I'm screwed. Let's get inside. If I just try and get over here, I can get... Oh, there, I'm through, I'm through. We're in! Oh, I suppose I hit me. The slow motion attack got me. Run! There is no salvation for you, Batania. Only death. That's pretty good. That was a. I'll help you, brother. We can fight them together. There's more reinforcements coming in. I think they're going for the keep. Not too fast. Uh, let's get my... Oh, it's, it's breaking again. No, I want to bring my guys into the... There you go, that's what I want to see. We're bringing my archers so they can hopefully shoot from inside. There are a bunch of guys on the walls and stuff everywhere, so you might get a few kills here. You never know. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it was a mistake. Nice. Okay, crossbowmen. See any prey? Yes, they do. <laughs> I don't know who they're aiming at. They're going to die. Oh, wait, maybe not. Ah, oh, I was really excited for a second. He is an immortal. He will never die. He died floating in midair. Cool. No worries, guys. I can save you, don't worry. Okay, I need to talk to the man inside this castle. My Excellent. On the seventh day of spring, 1086, Bowman married Dina. Wait, am I crying? <laughs> I'm overcome with emotion. You don't understand this day. Forevermore I pledge to protect you. 
from all the horrors of the world. Apart from myself, because I suck. Why am I crying? It's okay. Why have we invited Britannian peasants and sturgeons? It's a very confusing wedding. I guess no one wanted to join, so we just invited some random people. <laughs> okay, everybody. I think that's it for this episode. I have successfully managed to become a person that is married. Also, I think I've recorded way over what I should have done. I, I've got 40 minutes on this and like 20 minutes on the other one. It's going to be a long episode. My apologies, but it is what it is. Well, then, everybody, thank you for watching. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.